Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I wanted to show you what is in Baby Girl's diaper bag. So I will link the diaper bag down below, but I got it at Target. It was in my registry and I bought it. So yeah, let's show you what's inside. Starting on the back side of the diaper bag, I do have the nameplate uh, that will announce her name, birth and all of that which is in here. I'm not going to take it out because it has her name. But it also has the extra letters. And this is a changing pad uh, from Pampers. So that's in there. It's a little bit tight in there until we get that all out. Um, on this side pocket, we have the Pampers baby wipes, the sensitive ones. Uh, we just put a whole one in there. We haven't opened it yet, of course, since she's not here yet. But that's in there. On this other side, we have an insulated pocket and it has the Hakka. This is a manual silicone breast pump. So I plan on using this if she's hopefully latching and pulls from one breast. I will have the Hakka on the other to catch any leaky breast milk and of course to start to conserve the milk. I'm not really sure the verbiage or the wording on that. <laughs> so we have this pocket here which has some just plain old Ziploc bags. The reason why I have this is because if she does have like a soiled outfit or anything, uh, if we're out, we're able to put the dirty clothes in here and not like get anything on or in the diaper bag itself. On these outer pockets here, we have nothing. So here we'll probably have my wallet, cell phone, things like that. Uh, and then on this pocket, we have some nipples. Two of these Enfamil Noro Pro Infant Formula liquids. Um, I hear it's a good idea to have those in there just in case for any emergency and she needs to eat and I'm not able to provide her food. We have her little owl wubbanub. So cute. I have just a plain old thermometer. I'm working on getting the laser one or whatever it is that there is. I got some boogie wipe samples, so put that in here as well. And that's all that's in this pocket. Um, I know we'll probably bulk up a little bit more once she's here and we realize we do need more things. But for right now, that's pretty much all we have in those pockets. All right, the big boy. So it's fully loaded, fully packed. So the first thing we have is a warm um, blanket for her. Uh, she's going to be born in the middle of spring, so it might be a warm day, it might be a low 60s day. It just all depends on what weather Mother Nature wants to give us. So we have this in here just in case if we do need to bundle her up a little bit more um, than she will be already. We have two sets of baby mittens. We actually found these on Amazon. I think they are so stinking cute. So I have a white pair and a pink pair. Um, I like these better than the traditional mittens. For whatever reason I'm out of breath <laughs> we have some burp I don't know what these are called burp rags burp cloth burp burp things I have two of those like big ones so we can lay on our shoulder I have a muslin uh, muslin swaddle blanket in here we have this car seat cover and this is also I'll cover for myself if I am breastfeeding in public for whatever reason and I do need to cover myself uh, we definitely want to just keep her protected uh, as well as you know feed her if necessary we have some traditional bibs here I, I don't think she's gonna need them right off the bat but they're here just in case so we got two little bibs we have this other one here it's like another little it's probably like spit up rag or anything we can use that we have two pairs of socks just really cute little socks for her. We have the baby shisher. This was a highly recommended purchase, so we got it. And this is all it does. And I think it may work magic. We'll see. We have some different samples of diapers that we got. Um, we have a Pampers one, we have 17 generation, I'm um, not sure what these are, oh, Huggies, 
not sure what this is. But yeah, we have some different sizes as well as different brands in here. Uh, the main ones that we're going for are the Pampers. Uh, we also did get some Huggies though, but Pampers is the first choice. We have some Desitin in here for her. We have some Lanolin Cream. This will be for myself. It's just a small little size for me to try it out. I have some nipple covers, leak, whatever these are called, um, for the tatas if I do hopefully produce milk. And last but not least, we have four outfits for her. So I know this is a little excessive, huh? but I just, just want to have them in here for her. Um, of course, one will be the one that she comes home with, home in, and then the others will be in there uh, if we take her out for any reason and she does need a change. So the first outfit is actually a three month outfit and it's this little headband. Mind you, she's gonna be born in the spring, remember that. This little headband and just this onesie with this cute little rainbow, we love it. Um, no significance for the rainbow, but we just love the rainbow. So this is a little outfit for her and I like to put the headband right rolled in there with it so I know like these go together. The next <laughs> outfit for three months is actually a two-piece. So first we'll start with the headband. So we have this little headband for her. Hope you guys can see it with all this lighting. So it has this little top, which has a little bear. It's actually a little bear on it. Hope you guys can see that. And then it has the little bottoms with the footies in it. So I thought this was so cute. For her uh, depending on of course how big she is if she's a tiny little thing then we'll go for the newborn options that we chose so the two outfits the first ones that I showed are from Target so then we have I'm not sure where this is from let me see hold on a second I think this next outfit is actually from Walmart if I'm not mistaken it's just another onesie um, so this onesie will probably go with just another regular headband uh, like the ones that we do have here so this one will go with probably the white headband. No, Crystal wanted a black headband. We got to get her a black headband. So it's this onesie. This is actually a little newborn size. It's just full of flowers and different roses. And we just thought it was so cute. So this is one of the newborn outfits for her. And last but not least, it's probably my favorite outfit because it's so spring and it's so girly. So let me show you. So the first is the little headband, which I think is adorable. It's a little yellow headband so cute and it has a little onesie top adorable right and it has little ruffles across the collar area and then it has little bottoms which i think are just so cute so this is her another newborn outfit for her if she is of course this small this is most likely the outfit she's coming home in and I just am so excited and that concludes what's in my diaper bag I feel like it's a lot but then at the same time I feel like I'm probably missing so much let me know any other moms out there what you think I may be missing I would love to hear it because I probably am missing a couple of things Whew. Today I'm 39 weeks and two days, so baby girl should be here hopefully soon. Uh, let me know any tips, any anything that you have for me. I'm a first time mom. And yeah, I hope you guys liked this video. Let me know what you guys thought. Again, if there's anything you think I need in this bag, please let me know. I would love to hear your suggestions. And if I'm overpacking, don't tell me, I know. <laughs> but yeah, thank you so much for watching. And hopefully baby Camila will be here soon enough. Until next one, I love you guys and thank you so much for watching. Bye.